Natural join. We've learned about inner joins and several types of outer joins. Another join type is called a natural join. A natural join is where two tables are joined on columns that have the same name. An inner join is performed, but there is less code required. With an inner join, you need to specify the columns to join on. With a natural join though, you don't need to specify the columns. The syntax is to use the words natural join in place of join. It will join table 1 to table 2 on columns of the same name. It's helpful if your primary key and foreign keys have the same name. I'm showing you this join type so you know what it is. However, it's highly recommended not to use it. It needs both columns to have the same name. If the column names change, the query will stop working. If there are new columns added, then the query may stop working. Or, the query may keep working but show incorrect data. Let's see some examples of this anyway. Let's run a query with a natural join on the employee and department tables. We have our column names with an alias. Then we're going to go from employee E, then natural join, department D. Now let's run this query. You might get this error if we're using the natural join. It says column used in natural join cannot have a qualifier on line five, column one. This means that because we're using a natural join, it joins on the department ID. So we can't have the table alias there or the qualifier next to department ID. Let's run the query again. You can see our results here. This works because the column names are the same. Now, let's try and join the product table to the department table. We've selected our columns. We have our first table and then natural join, and then natural join department. If we run this query, we can see our products and departments. This query also works because the column names are the same in both tables. So that's how you use a natural join. As mentioned earlier, I recommend not using them and having an inner join instead. It's a little more code, but it's much easier to maintain and will cause less issues in the future. Next, we'll take a look at a Cartesian join.